Do you like silver Morgan dollars? Do you like silver piece dollars? Does this intro sound familiar to you? If you watch our videos, it should. This video is the next in our series dedicated to the 2021 silver Morgan and piece dollars. And we will talk about important updates and additional information about them. In other words, this video will cover everything you need to know about the upcoming 2021 Morgan and Peace Dollars. Hey YouTubers, this is JNB and welcome to our JB Coins family. We're all about coins and currency. We have new videos every day and are here to help you either start your new collection, expand an existing one, or maybe find that one valuable coin that can change your life. Now if you watch our videos, you will know that we have many videos dedicated to the new 2021 Morgan and 2021 Peace Centennial Dollars, marking the 100th anniversary of the transition of production between the two silver dollar series. We were even involved in passing the bill to produce them. The 2021 dated silver dollars were authorized under provisions of the 1921 Silver Dollar Coin Anniversary Act, Public Law 116-286. And now we are very happy to announce the U.S. Mint release dates, pricing, surface finishes, and mintages. We've talked about it many times during our streams, but since not everybody's watching our live streams, we decided to share with everybody this important info. So after watching this video, you will know everything there is to know about the 2021 Morgan and Peace dollars. The silver Morgan dollars will be minted at the Philadelphia, Denver, and San Francisco mints. Those from Denver and San Francisco will carry respectively the D and S mint marks. Morgan dollars from the Philadelphia Mint will not have a mint mark, just like the original issues didn't have a P mint mark. The Philadelphia Mint will produce Morgan dollars with O and CC privy marks for the former New Orleans and Carson City Mints in honor of their Morgan silver dollar production. 2021 Peace Dollars will only be minted at the Philadelphia Mint, and they will not have a mint mark. All six silver dollars will be struck with an uncirculated finish, the same satiny finish used for uncirculated commemorative silver dollars. All five of the 2021 Morgan dollars will be limited to a release of 175,000 coins per version, while the 2021 Peace Dollar will be struck with a mintage ceiling of 200,000 coins with a household limit of 25 for each of the six in the set. All six coins will be offered at $85 per coin. These coins will contain 0.999 fine silver, so 11% more silver than the 0.900 fine silver originals. The Mint will be taking pre-orders finally. The product shipments will not begin until October though. So, if you're planning on buying yours, the first chance you'll have is at noon Eastern Time, May 24th. The Mint plans to open ordering for two of the 2021 Morgan dollars, the one with the CC Privy Mark and the second bearing the O Privy Mark. The pre-sale period runs through 3 p.m. Eastern Time, June 7th. The privy marks appear in the same position on the reverse as the mint marks do on the originals, below the eagle's tail feathers. The CC privy mark is presented in cues on a cartouche, while the O privy mark has a dot in the center. On June 1st, the mint will start taking online orders for the 2021 D Morgan dollars to be struck at the Denver Mint and the 2021 S Morgan dollar to be struck at the San Francisco Mint. 
Pre-orders run through 3 p.m. Eastern Time, June 14th. On June 7th, online orders will be accepted for the 2021 Morgan Dollar to be struck at the Philadelphia Mint without a mint mark, the way the Morgan Dollars were struck a century and more ago at that facility. Orders will also be accepted for the Lone Peace Dollar, marking the centennial. The 2021 coin also struck without a mint mark at the Philadelphia Mint. The pre-order period will run through 3 p.m. Eastern Time, June 21st. So make notes, everybody, of these dates. And for more info, visit the U.S. Mint website. We truly are excited about them. The price, in our opinion, is a bit on the high end. And with six coins needed to complete the set, might not be affordable for everyone. But they should go up in value over time. At least that's what we think. What do you guys think? Please let us know in the comments section below. We read all your comments. Also, if you like valuable quarters, please watch our video linked in the upper corner of this one. We also would like to say thank you to all of our JB Coins Inc. members. If you'd like to become a JB Coins Inc. family member, please follow the link below this video. We greatly appreciate it. So we hope you liked this video and found it helpful. And if you did, please like, share, and subscribe so we can create more videos for you. Also, please remember to hit the little bell and set it so you'll be notified whenever we upload a new video or do a live stream. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.